Yo, what is up, everybody? Welcome back to Great Indie Madoka Magica. Tonight, we are watching a bunch of random things. Um, Most notably, it includes the Walsh Bernard Rising teaser trailer and the concept movie trailer, whatever that even means. Um, But we're also watching the OP for the, like, recap movies that, like, for season one called, like, Beginnings and Eternal. We're watching that OP because I haven't seen that yet. And also um, some of the transformations from Magia Record, which is, I think, the game. So, yeah, a bunch of random stuff, but... um. Most notably, of course, being the teasers for the next movie, because that's always fun to look at. I thought we would look at it together. Wow, isn't that so fun? Um, but yeah, so obviously, if you've been watching the the Madoka, Magis, Madoka Magica stuff, you know we already watched the movie um, Rebellion, and we watched the normal series. Haven't watched any of the other stuff yet, so this is kind of like a capstone to that stuff. Um, maybe we'll get into some of the side stories at some point. Um, but for now, this is just kind of where we're at, and it should be fun. Uh, so yeah, let's honestly just start. We're going to start with the, the less exciting stuff and get into the more exciting stuff. So first, we're doing the transformation scenes from Magia Record, or whatever that's called. And then we're doing the OP for the movie, and then we're doing the concept movie trailer, and then we're doing the teaser. So we, we got that nice ramp up, you know what I'm talking about. So yeah, let's honestly just get into the first one here. This is a nice little six minute video. This is also apparently what the game looks like, I'm guessing. Uh, what's most notable to me is like they got their like elements or whatever. I mean, let's look at this. Like Sayaka, water, that's perfect. Kyoko, fire, that's pretty perfect. What does mommy have? Up arrow? Madoka's got like light. God Madoka just has all of them. <laughs> like, is that balanced? And then of course Homer has got like the, the moon one because, you know, she got to be edgy with it. Well, let me just analyze their stats real quick. Honestly, Sayaka having the most health I think is very fitting. That's kind of funny. Kyoko doesn't have the most attack. Mmm, she kind of balanced though, not gonna lie. Um, yeah, honestly. Oh, look, there's the little thing at the bottom that's like their, their like synergies. Wait, water beats fire. Fi okay, now this is stupid. Let's just watch the actual video. Three, two, one, bang. Ah, they're all support too. Are they all support classes? What does that even mean? Oh, it's like actually animated. That's kind of sick. I'm guessing all those girls in the back were like, uh,. I don't know. The uh, ones throughout history. Oh, she like caught herself. That's kind of cute. Aw, that was kind of sweet. Touch screen. Wow. Okay, let's go to the next one. Uh, the person controlling this. Come on, the button's right there. Kyoko's next in line. Mommy, we're doing mommy. Why? Okay, I'm not. Let me let me just enjoy this. Okay, shut up, shut up. Oh shoot, A little dress up doll action. Oh my goodness. I guess it's fitting with like the ribbon aesthetic, right? Oh, it was a two-parter. Okay. Dang, mommy looks like a grown adult in that. Did you see her there for a second? When she was actually like before magical magical girl trip. Yeah, give me Sayaka. Let's do it. Hmm. Diving deep into the water. Oh, mommy's actually here. What's up? Why <laughs> are they just throwing Sayaka around? <laughs> Aw, hi Sayaka. Aw, Kyoko put her like pin in. Oh, she had to get her hair cut, too. That was a good one. I like that one, actually, a lot. I wonder why the other girls were in it. That's kind of specific. And why she had long hair. That's like a god thing. I mean, going off of god Madoka. It almost looked like they were, like, reviving her from being dead. Of course Kyoko's playing da dog dance machine or whatever it's called. Yeah? <laughs> Is she really strutting down the staircase? The fire, because I feel like they had fire imagery with the whole family dying thing too, which makes that actually kind of really sad. Yeah, she doesn't look happy to be there either. She's kind of upset about it. Understandably, I, I suppose. Wow, look at all the characters at the bottom. Why are there so many? Oh, we got Twink. Uh, Twink's not the right word. Beta, Beta Homura. I know there's proper terminology. I ain't memorizing that. A <laughs> loading screen? Okay. Hmm. 
A little bit of time action, respectable. Hi, Omura. Look how happy she was before everything went horribly wrong. <laughs> before the story caught up with her. Poor thing. All right, normal Homura. Oh good, we have her killing a Madoka at to start. Yeah? Oh, that's scary. Okay, she got a tr crazy transformation in this one. She's actual crystalline. Huh. That's interesting. Coated. She was like coated in like reflective material. And then of course she got the moon in the backdrop because you know, it's kind of her thing. What says God Madoka? All right. Cube, get off of my screen. <laughs> Uh. Wait, this one's kind of good. I like this one. She got shattered into a million pieces. A million Madokas. Go forth, Madoka. And they do be doing ballet, though, not gonna lie. Mm. Mm. And that was like her human form turning to dust now that the god Madoka pulled up. Oh my goodness. She's the caretaker of the planet. Ah, oh, thanks Madoka, I appreciate that. Wait, there's no there's no landmass on that, that's just blue. Okay. I'll let it slide. Is that all of it? I think it's all of it. There's more. Wait, there's more, there's more. Who is it? Another- wait, Kyoko again? No? Oh, they don't know what's going on. They're, they don't know where it is. Where is it? Oh, Bebe! Okay, okay. I'm good with this. I'm fine with Bebe. Do they really have this for all the characters in this game? That's kind of insane to me. <laughs> you can see they restarted it because the video. The video didn't play, so they restarted it. Oh, that's so funny. Okay, works this time. Good. <laughs> oh, Madoka's playing it. God, Madoka. Yeah, because she's like, I guess she probably selected like a um, someone to join the Holy Quintet, right? Or yeah, because Baby was part of the team with Sayaka to like go into the world. So this is like God, Madoka being like, hey, I choose you, little cheese cheese goblin. You got a megaphone. What was that alert, bro? <laughs> Silence your notifications. <laughs> okay. I liked this. I think my favorite part of this video was watching the person fumbling, trying to record it. Oh my goodness. All these people in the background are kind of sick. I have... They're probably the other characters in the game or whatever. This one reminds me of Kite from Hunter x Hunter. This one next to Madoka there. Um... Mommy's one. Let, let me get a peek up real quick of that grown-up mommy they showed for like a split second. That was this mommy. She looks grown woman. That she looks like like she's like or, like mid twenties. That's my girl right there in the full fit. And then she goes into like she literally looks like she unages. Yeah, I'm frame by framing it. What are you gonna do? Stop me? Is it is her hair getting shorter? Hmm. Yeah, her hair goes from mid back to up. Maybe they literally in like the the story of whatever's going on are like unaging or something. Or like and by unaging I mean reverse aging. Cuz they did a similar thing with Sayaka. Though Sayaka was dying and everybody had to help her out. And by help her out I mean just throw her into bed and then Homer like laundry machine dryers her. But look, her hair's super long. Oh, I love how she gives her the pin though. What a power duo. I freaking love Sayaka. Kyoko's one is just sad though. Like the burning. 
it's like from the ashes right from the ashes of like her traumatic backstory boom we got we got modern day kyoko and she's just frowning because you know she's had it rough can't blame the girl um beta homura just doing beta homura things some some cool like reversing time imagery and etc a lot of like paper focus too what are these are these like the other magical girls like a bunch of randos that looks like a homura yeah i don't freaking know oh this was trippy this was actually good where they play them using the like definite or like like subdue it domain madoka's backward run looks so goofy <laughs> madoka what are you doing Doom -de -doom -de. sorry she's so easy to make fun of madoka i love her though and like the chorus of madoka's coming together make god madoka here for that protector of the planet little creepy but i'll let it slide because you're you know you're, you're you're doing this for like the good of everything and then baby's just babying it up all right that was good i enjoyed that pog <laughs> sayaka getting hazed by her own squad wait that's actually true wait is this spoilers this is probably kind of spoilerly i mean they, they start to say like it's them as adults going back to kids which is what i was prophesizing wait, was kyoko's also doing that Oh yeah, her hair's super long too. Hmm, interesting. Okay, well, read into that if you want to. I'm not. I'm gonna purposefully not give it very much thought because it's not anything that I've experienced in the story though. Um, next, OP. Wait, no, don't just start it. Go back. Okay, OP for the movie. Three, two, one, bang. Wait, 1080p, run it back, nine seconds, nine seconds, bang. Just had to be sure, just had to be sure. I gotta enjoy, I don't have to like, okay, shut up, shut up. Aw, <laughs> little Homer and Madoka, so friendly. Those are some interesting outfits. There's no way this is for the movie. This is a spoiler. Baby Madoka, bro? Toddler Madoka, bro? Kindergarten Madoka? Track? Whoa. Aw, childhood friend Sayaka and Hitomi. Oh, she was pregnant with a little baby boy. That's not Bobby Kyoko. Homer in your medicine cabinet, aka the hospital. Squad up. A lot of focus on the Madoka Homer. Wow, you are so gay for each other. It is adorable. I honestly, it's pro it probably goes both ways. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> Madoka just isn't aware of it yet. I'm going to be real. Oh, that was cute. The bubbles. This is for the recap movie, right? Beginnings Eternal. I'm pretty sure it is. That's crazy to me that they showed this. You're gonna show me God Madoka, huh? With the ultra long hair. I mean, it's a crazy shot, but come on. What are y'all wearing? It's like a, it's like a, I don't know what the name of that kind of dress is, but look at the, why do they have one tiny sleeve on their arms? Do you see that? Show me it, this thing. What is that? And y'all got collars on too, bro. I'm gonna be real, that's not the fit. Wait, no, keep going. Yeah, I want to watch Baby Madoka again. Such an odd thing to, to, to have, like her growing up as a child. Oh, it's Sayaka! Bro, I didn't even notice. Who is that? Is that Hitomi? I think this is the full squad. Sayaka, Violin Boy, I'm never going to know his name. Hitomi in the background. This is her when she's about to meet her friends. Why is Sayaka striking that pose when she's like seven, bro? Sayaka has way too much confidence for a seven-year-old. At least Violin Boy is nice and respected. Sayaka's got way attitude. And then Madoka's just like trembling. She looks like she got a pee. Okay, random, random running. Cute childhood friends. 
She's like listening to the the, the freaking uh the baby. She's listening to the baby, right? When she puts her head up to the womb. That's very sweet, very cute. Mommy, where are your parents at? <laughs> I know where Kyoko's parents are at. Whoa! <laughs> Homer, I don't know where your parents are at either. You're neglected. Wait, they're actually all- are they all neglected? Except Madoka and maybe Sayaka. But I mean, debatable even with Sayaka, right? None of them get to- I mean, I can't tell if it's like we're not shown it just because there's not enough time in the story or if it's actually absent. I mean, at least in Kyoko's case, we know it's absent because we're told that like her entire family died and she still got so much confidence and like, it's so cool with it despite all the trauma. That's my girl Kyoko right there. But like Homer, where's her family at, hmm? You woke up in the hospital and no one's sitting in this chair? She's definitely neglected. No one's in the chair. She She's basically main character status along with Madoka. Like we would know, wouldn't we? I think, I think I've also heard that she has like a Catholic family or something. I don't know. I don't know if that's true though. Oh wait, get off my screen. I still think Sayaka's like, the way they play with the transformations is so good with Sayaka. Like the exploring of like the mechanics of the magical girl with like all the witch stuff and the detaching yourself from the pain stuff, bro. They ace it with Sayaka. Can you explain how much budget went into this hair though? Look at this. That was like a year off of someone's lifespan trying to animate that. Very nice. Yeah, we're, I'm, I'm, I liked it, it was good. Oh, lyrics. Okay, I don't know why I read all that. Um, there wasn't really anything important. So I'm still surprised they showed the the final form of Madoka here because like showing her magical girl form and then it like a magical girl form plus is like a really large piece of information. So, wait, what is this? Wait, I'm gonna click it. And if I don't know what it is, I'm gonna click off it. Oh, it's an AMV. Okay, <laughs> don't worry about it. Hey, shout out to my boy Zumptai. Zump Tumpai? I don't know how to pronounce your name. Shout out to you for me clicking on your video. Alright, bye bye. Oh, I haven't been liking these. Oh, that's okay. I'll look, I'll look. Bing, bong, concept movie trailer. I'll, I'll, I'll like Walsh Bernard Rising as well. Okay, let's get into it. Wait, look, this is them being gay. They're so cute. Okay, <laughs> let's just watch the, watch the uh, concept movie trailer English sub. Three, two, one. Bang. Oh, this is janky. Look at this. World recording bar. I actually have to pay attention to this. The other two were more just for fun, right? Okay. The ballet foot, that's pretty striking. Oh, there's a giant head. It's uh, Majora's Mask, bro. Who is that? Oh, it's Madoka. Whoa. Whoa! Right, I mean, because we're doing this all for like, uh, I don't know, like Homura. A lot of this relates to Homura and Madoka, like obviously, right? I'm not going to have to spell it out for y'all. The goddess, yeah. And like why, why Homura brought her back down to human form. A lizard girl. Oh my goodness, swans with swords in them, dude. Homer is a lizard now? Okay. Wow, I like the Madoka ballet thing though. That's a sick little thing though. Kyoko? Homer. Uh... Whose voice is that? 
Look at Kyoko making moves. There's Saika's uh, Saika witch form. Which is interesting. Why are we seeing that in a movie? Oh, look, Saika's, like, dead. Why can't I read these characters? Whoa, whoa. She was pinned to the ground, whoever that was. What's up, baby? Bro, imagine Kyubei is, like, tortured by all the stuff Homura did to him, and he's trying to break, like, break it apart just because he's freaking out, like... He's helping our team. It's like a team up to fight against Homura. That could be something. Is that mommy? Oh, that's mommy. What's up, mommy? How are you doing? What is that? Is that Walsh Vermont? I don't know. Is Madoka gonna like self sac herself to appease Homura, but Homura is still gonna do something crazy? That'd be something. Is that mommy? Mommy, why are you leading a, a, a giant ship out of the planet? I don't even know what this is supposed What concept for what? Concept movie four, so I assume for Walsh Not Rising. Oh my gosh, don't look at my YouTube stuff, bro. I'm, I wanna watch that again. What were you saying about happiness? You were spitting some some bars. Okay. Happiness is the bright sunbeams of May, a warm family, sunny side up eggs for breakfast. Heaven, heaven has none of these things. Yup, yup. And then they and then they move the idea. They're like, okay, heaven doesn't have it. What about the bonds between people? You know, your name being called, calling someone's name, being wanted, wanting. Bars. Someone thinking about you. I mean, this is super relevant to Madoka Homura. The goddess had none of those things. That's why we got rid of her, says Homura. Take pity on the goddess. That's pretty true. I wonder why they're calling her a lizard girl. That's an interesting translation of whatever was there. Man. It's like the, the balance, the balancing act of everything, right? Her, her with the ballet. Till that cruelty, that gentle radiance was too dazzling. There's been a lot of cat, a lot of dead cats. Schrodinger's cat situation. I don't know. That's probably not what they're talking about. This is crazy to me. I don't know what all this like blocks are. I mean, there's like salt cubes, sugar cubes floating. Sayaka. I mean, why is Sayaka a witch? I thought she was not going to be a. Well, no, didn't she still have the ring a little bit? She had the mark at the end of the movie, uh, at the end of her rebellion. I mean. She had something. She was still like, I, I think she's going to be the clutch. I hate people who point a blade at someone else. How are, you, are Kyoko and Sayoka still arguing? Y'all. <laughs> they had their memories messed with. It's okay. Why can I read? Oh, I read it wrong. What? You don't know how to, or you, you, you're confused why you can read? Interesting. Maybe it's like magical girl characters or something like like this weird cultish stuff that like the memory was erased from her mind, but out of just mind habit, she's still able to read it. She's like, wait, I was never taught how to do this. And then Hitomi just walking. Who's this? I mean, they're pinned to the ground. Who the heck are you? Is that Sayaka? I think that's Sayaka. It's like, there's some weird lighting. Bro, Homer is gonna put Sayaka into, in like, into containment. For like, and like, put all- This looks like Homer's room, dog. Sayaka's gonna get put into containment for becoming a witch. And like, popping off. And then Homer is gonna try to like, hide her. And then everyone's gonna be like, where did Sayaka go? It's a mystery. Who, you know, that could be something. Kyubei's gonna be a big part too, I mean, obviously, right? He's got all the curses of the world inside him. He probably isn't a huge fan of that. And Mommy's gonna come clutch it out, too, because Mommy's got, like, the highest potency. She's OP, honestly. 
mean, is this I, is this a is this a witch? Is this mommy's witch? Is this Walsh or not? That's some crazy animation too. Yeah, and Madoka's trying to like placate placate Homura, offering herself a little self sacrificing Madoka. Well, she loves to self sac, bro. Because she's desperate, she doesn't think she's like worth very much, and so she's told, "Oh, you're worth something, but only if you die." Then she's like, "Oh, I can finally be worth something." Not necessarily die, but you know, she has a low self worth, and she wants to have like a big impact on the world. So if she's offered something at the cost of herself that can impact the world, she has a habit of taking that. That's kind of my idea, though. Bro, what's up with mommy? Why are you golden? I swear, is mommy, like, <laughs> leading an armada? Mommy teams up with Kyube and fights back against Homura after Sayaka goes missing, who was captured by Homura for becoming a witch and trying to stop Homura, that then dragged Kyoko into problems. Boom! That's what I'm guessing. Complete, complete mystery. No idea. That was sick, though. Pog. Oh, wait, look at this. Look at this. They're talking about it. I don't want to read what you're saying. Okay, final one. Wash Bernard Rising teaser trailer. June 30th, 2021. That's pretty recent. It is October 15th, 2022. All right, let's watch this. Three, two, one. Bam. A new flex. That's what we like to hear. Oh, this movie's about to be so good. Okay. She do be kind of fragmented, though. Whoa, whoa. Okay, that was kind of hype. But that's it? This was good. This was good. Look at this. Ah, yeah. Hmm. Not much to read into there, huh? Let's continue our story. Oh, it's our story. Aww. Look, you can still see the cracked glass. Imagine if they start getting meta with it. Madoka's get climbing into our reality. Homura, <laughs> Homura's in your in your room. Interesting. The beginning of a new chapter. Oh yeah, I mean that's true. If they say new chapter, then yeah, how much how much more juice is gonna get is gonna get spilled? Because it was pretty, like, I don't know. Like, uh, end of season one was, a, like, an ending. And then Rebellion was, like, an open-ended ending. And so, like, are they going to do another movie that has, like, another ending? Or are they going to straight, like, you know, boom, season two or something crazy? I'm just, it's so interesting to me that Madoka Magica. Because it's obviously pretty popular, right? Like, I... I, I'm a, it's one of the big, big boys in town. So how is it that the main story itself only has 12 episodes in one movie? It gets all this spinoff stuff. It's getting like m these games. It's getting these slot machines. It's getting all sorts of crap. But there's like, how long has Madoka Magica, Madoka Magica anime episode one. I'm going to have to cut that out. I just doxed myself so hard. Uh, date, January, uh, 2011. Okay, so it's been 11 years. I don't know. I just feel like they would be given more stuff in the main line. That's crazy. Honestly, though, I'm excited for that movie. I wish I knew a date that it would come out so I could freaking, you know, be ready for it. But I don't. Not yet. I'm sure y'all will let me know as soon as it does. Um, Bro, they're about to do something. I don't even know what they're about to do. I mean, I think they're going to be using Kyubei a lot. Considering that Kyubei was in such an, a specific situation, um... Also considering how Kyube views emotion as a mental illness, because that's kind of what the um, the hive mind has thought. And so now that he has all this <laughs> curse <laughs> pounded into him, uh, I'm guessing he's probably going to be like forced into an emotion state, like resentment or something. I could see that being pretty interesting, uh, which then would give him, I don't know, a reason to fight back against Homura. And then maybe he teams up with somebody, mommy, they make a ship together. I don't freaking know. But, like, Homura's OP right now. She's got the crazy gym. So, 
I don't know. No, it should be interesting. And like Sayaka, I think Sayaka's gonna try to solo it because she's got like a little bit of Magical Girl stuff in her or something. She's gonna get rolled and smoked, but by getting rolled and smoked is gonna set off a warning alarm to everybody. And then Cube works with whoever to make things happen. I mean, it's just kind of a Hail Mary. You know, there's not the most to work with. Well, I, there's actually a decent amount. I mean, Madoka's doing ballet and stuff. I mean, this is just her human form, like what she takes up um, in Homer's new world that she's created. Wow, that felt like Death Note there, what I just said. The new world. Hmm. But the like Sayaka becoming a witch here. That's why I'm thinking that Sayaka's gonna like try to to solo it. Um, maybe she's n not even gonna just become a witch, but she's like doing the dualism witch and magical girl thing that we saw in the Rebellion movie, which is still like the coolest thing in the show. One of the coolest things, because I mean we see her right here like projecting it outwards, and she's in this wall. This is like the Walsh Bernard area. I mean, is Sayaka gonna try to fight Walsh Bernard? But why are there witches? There shouldn't be the Walsh. Why is Walsh Bernard here? If they, I thought Homer said no Walsh Bernards. There's an entire video called Sayaka's Motives in Rebellion, bro. I honestly need to watch that. <laughs> uh, and then she gets put in containment. I literally think she like tries to solo it using her dualism witch and magical girl form. Gets contained by Homura. And then, I mean, we got Hitomi doing this really edgy walk, but why is she, what is she trying to, what is Sayaka trying to do? I mean, is she fighting Homura? Is she fighting Walsh or not? I mean, this is an entire destroyed cityscape. Homura does still have time rewinds. Maybe we'll see a lot of different, or presumably she still has time rewinding, right? So maybe we'll see a bunch of different lines. Maybe something crazy like, uh, I don't know, because I'm, I'm trying to think, if we even have time resetting, then that gives Homura so much power that I don't see how we would like end the story with Homura not in full control still. Like if she's doing these time resets, unless the time resets weren't actually fully resetting time. Like an example being Sayaka does a bunch of stuff, Homura resets time, but Sayaka still remembers it or some of the vestiges of that time like carry on to Sayaka. But that's not how it's been in the past, so I couldn't really see that being a thing. Um... I don't know, and it's interesting. There's there's a lot of stuff that could be happening. And like, Kyoko's fighting a bunch of like, aliens from Mars. What are these? This is Homura, dude. This is Homura and all, all her little doll things. Do we know who's fighting her here? No. So yeah, I think the Magical Girl gang, the Holy Quinn, what's it called? Holy Quintet uh, minus Homura is going to be trying to fight well, I don't have to say minus Homura because Bebe, right? <laughs> That's a quintet right there. I was going to be like either... Maybe this is like Cube spawn. Because Cube has got all the curse stuff in him, but like, are we still having to deal with like some of the entropy stuff? Are we still going to be dealing with all the negative emotions and stuff? Like maybe Cube not a strong enough vessel to contain everything. Some of it leaks. Homura has the magical girls deal with it, but then they turn on Homura for obvious reason. Once they figure some stuff out. Maybe Kyubei helps that facilitate that, um, which leads to Mommy going on a crusade, Sayaka getting captured, Kyoko, Kyoko in it up. I mean, they're literally, I think they're fighting Homura, or Homura's fighting someone else, like Kyubei spawn or something in this shot, because I mean, look, it's it's crazy demon-winged Homura and all their little baby balls, baby dolls, whoa. <laughs> and like the head falling out of the sky, I mean, I don't know, I don't know, dude. This is a crazy shot, though. I like when they do Madoka in this style. I think Madoka looks really interesting. This, like, weird, like, gothic, gothic fairy tale storybook style, or whatever you want to call it. Juicy stuff. Honestly, though, that'll probably do it for this little um, fun bundle of Madoka Magic stuff. Uh, if you made it to the 35, 40 minute mark in the video, then I assume... It's actually probably not that long because I cut it down. But if you made it this far into the video, I assume you like it. So I would appreciate it if you hit any buttons that you would like to, you know, subscribe. If you're a new blah, 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 you know how it goes. Hit all the buttons down below. Comment down below if you have anything to say. Plug, plug, plug. Uh, but until then, that's all I got for this Madoka Magica Bunch. I'll be seeing you on the next thing. Peace.